perform with fingerless gloves. And the men competing in this featherweight contest, Sasha Moisa against Shazib Rind. So three three-minute rounds, the 10-point must system back in play. Three knockdowns in a round mean a technical knockout. No elbows in this one. We all know the rules in the back. You guys know what I expect. We will have a clean fight. Remember, no strikes in the back of the head. Watch the spine strikes. Watch the low strikes, all right? You want to touch gloves? Do so now. Back up to your corner. Featherweight division then. Shazib Rind, 21 Judge years one. old. Judge 75 and three. three. Back there. As a kickboxer right, from time. Pakistan. His opponent, 38 and eight. 25 years old from Ukraine. Sasha Moisa, we saw him last at the Featherweight World Grand Prix. Unfortunately, he was taken out by Smoke and Joe Nadawat. But now, since that bout, he's picked up the World Lethweight Championship. He's back here in one Warrior Series, Go. looking to make his way back to one championship. And that Lethweight stuff is hardcore, my goodness me. Spinning back fist from Rind, who looks in good shape. He really does look well conditioned. Team kick was caught for a moment and then released, which is all very good. Shazai, the Wushu stylist. Sasha with more kickboxing and Muay Thai experience. I think the difference in this bout will be the knees. Sasha Moisa will look to land those knees from close distance. Not a very fast start from these two. They're being cautious. Three rounds in this one, nine minutes in total. Judges score round by round, but it's not a sprint. Pulled out of the spinning back kick or back fist or whatever that was going to be. Ended up just simply being a pirouette. Oh, they're looking for the big punch, the two of them, aren't they? It's not about the accumulation of punches here, not yet at least. Sounding each other out, looking to open the other up and see if they can land that big bomb. Yeah, nice kick to the outside of the left thigh. And he gets a little single clap applause. And there's another spin to negligible effect, I would say. Whoa. Back up. It's a slip. Go. Yeah, it was a slip. Referee quite right. Shazaib has a very dynamic style. You see him going to the spins a lot. Yeah, he hasn't made it work for himself yet, though, has he? Let's see if he continues with that line of thinking. Moisa not quite throwing as much as his opponent. Well, he's done it again, and again, nothing comes of it. Nothing was attempted even. He's trying to set up the kick off the spin, Steve. So he's looking to land the spinning back fist. And if he misses, following up with the kick behind it. Well, while he was doing all that, Moisa sent in a nice little left jab that landed very cleanly. He's 0 for 4 on the spins. We'll keep you abreast of how that develops at home. Final 10 seconds, three minute rounds, these. So he can't afford to waste time. Let's have a look at one piece of action from that first round. The busier athlete certainly was Rin. But that was a decent left hand from Moisa, wasn't it? Yeah, a little exchange. Shazab with the kick. Sasha returns. But then Shazab has this unorthodox style. He'll throw punches and kicks on off angles, off timing. And I think that's getting to Sasha Moisa. Sasha hasn't been able to find his timing yet. Sasha Moisa, a Muay Thai athlete, as you said, Grand Prix experience. Seems very, very at ease there, listening to his corner men. I think the message there was just to step things up a little bit. It wasn't the most intense three minutes we've ever seen. And that's okay. Two, let's go. Filling each other out. But I think the message to Moiser is let's just take it up a notch. And the early signs are that he's obeying those commands. 
as is Rind, by the way. Yeah, we've really, we've really stepped up, haven't we? Already. Often the way in kickboxing. But the second round is a, a far greater pace than the first. And that was a spin that <laughs> did generate a connection, but it was followed up by one that did not. That, that one got the gloves. So he's one for seven. I'll do my best to keep count for you. Goes downstairs with the kick. Nice left hand from Rin there as well. Sasha Moisa pressuring forward. <laughs> Closing the distance on Rin. A nice right hand from Moisa. Rin stays in the pocket though. They're well matched these two. Now they've stepped it up a little bit. All of our bots tonight have been very, very well matched. Yeah, true. Great very job true. to the matchmakers here. And one warrior, she's Bashir Ahmad. One of the matchmakers here. Liking that left hand of Moisa. Step back, Frank! Frank, let's go! Again, 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 let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go, come on. Rind looks slightly taller. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. And he looks good, doesn't he? He's got a, he's got a nice stance there. Yes. Oh, that right hand in, but it was countered. Yes. Oh, it goes downstairs yes. nicely. That's good work from Moisa there. Started downstairs and then came up top, exchanging knees to the fight. Let's go. No way. On the outside, Wind is landing the shots, but when they get inside, Moisa is starting to land those hard punch combinations and knees. 45 seconds left of the second round. Moisa sends that left hand in again, not with quite as much persuasion as he did earlier on in this round, though. There's another spinner, he's on nine. Uh, ten. So he's, he's hit double figures. Really only got through cleanly with one of them. Getting closer, though, he's, he's, he's hitting the gloves. There's, an, there's another one of those sort of non-event spins. <laughs> and really, when you consider how many times he's tried that, it's a little bit of a surprise that Moisa hasn't tried to, to pick him apart. There it is again, just for good measure, before we come to the end of this second round. So, not such an easy one for the judges to pull these two apart, actually. Remember, scoring round by round, but whoever's won these first two, it'll be by a very tight margin. This is some of the right hands by Moise in the second round. He started to walk forward, started to put the pressure on Shazayib. But on the outside, Shazayib still landing his low kicks, still landing his high kicks, and occasionally a few spins. One chooses to sit, the other chooses to stand. You close and going up, 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 up. Like Moisa close, like close. looking uh, focused, like don't be like this. quite relaxed. Rins, knees Let's shaking. Let's go. Let's go, bro. High yeah. activity. Let's go. Let's go. Doubtless can't wait to get back Mal into it. Mal so the instruction from the corner says Sasha Moisa to stay in tight when he gets inside, try to land body shots. That's great. Great cornerman work. It really could be close enough, and I, I wouldn't venture to say who's won either of the rounds we've seen so far, but it's quite likely that if either athlete can dominate this third and final round, with it will go the contest. Good left hand from Moiser, but he took a couple of counters from Rind in return. Good kick to the leg there from Rind as he came out of that spinning attempt. Keeping his opponent at distance with that long left leg of his. Brings up that knee. 